Hello, my internet friends. Nabiet here. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. This is a large scout. There we go. Woo. Yeah, I thought it was a large UFO. It's not. It's a large scout, which is a slightly different thing. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Right, we've got authorization. Let's let's do it. I wouldn't have done it without authorization. Yeah, large scout, slightly different. I think there's three packs, but what we need to be careful of now is like slightly tougher enemies turning up. I'm waiting for like mechanical enemies to turn up at this stage. And I did a mission once on this map where that really happened and kind of. Oh, there's a the mutant. It was really, there you go, cyber disc. They, they really, I was really ill prepared for it. That's why I'm with my heavies. I always go for that heat ammo to do extra damage for when these, usually when the first wave of guys turn up for mechanical guys. I'm not going to get them held again. So just keep echo back. This is a really weird map for covering people with snipers. Really hard to get lines of sight and stuff. You hear that? Yeah, whatever, whatever. I'm not going to get very much meld on this run through. I'm just wondering whether or not to go wide and try and flank around, but I don't think it's worth it. It could be anywhere, basically. You guys just nicely move slowly. Right uh, there he is. Get some. One, two. Miss. Hit. There we go. We take the drone out? I think we took the drone out. Oh, that's good. Ah! Always freaks me out when they do that. Oh, God, I hate that motion because you think you're going to throw the grenade. I think, I don't know, in sometimes, I think there's a mod you can add where they kind of fire robotic enemies when they see you. Yeah. We shred him. There's no reason to not kind of pound on this guy and just get rid of him. Never mind. Go on. Oh, nice. Well, heat ammo was no use, was it? But, you know, you've always got hollow target. I always have hollow targeting, so it's always worth firing with the heavy. And if you hit him with the heat ammo, get some extra. You know, you know, you know what I mean. Liquid sectoids. I hope that's not a flipping. Nah. I thought it might be the. You kind of feel sorry for them, don't you? I thought that might have been one of the sectoids in its mech suit, but I'm not quite there yet. Ah, oh, bless him. <laughs> He's hanging in there. <laughs> oh. You try to flank me, save your little sectoid mate, it's not going to work. I do love rockets. Go on. Don't go wide, please. One down, several to go. He's out in the open, so this should be a good percentage. Hmm. Mechs don't have amazing aim. See us later. Dude, you are valiant until the end. Don't listen. That could be it. I'm pretty sure that's it. <sighs> nice coffee. Right, let's all move up. 
What yeah, pretty sure it's just the outsider left. That seemed like really easy. Uh, and it's just kind of look at the drawer, I guess. A little bit of good luck earlier on with levels and stuff, so we're in a good position to tackle things, but I have done playthroughs where... Um, ah, jeez. I'm going to have to do something about her aim, even though, you know, with rapid fire, even though she's close. I'm being flanked! Headed there now. Bye bye! Oh no, not a bye bye. Come on, do something. Another day, another successful operation. Yeah, so that was okay. We're getting some good. Loots and stuff from. We're just doing work at the minute with these basic missions. So, covert up next, scope upgrade. I'm going to get that scope for Mantis. Yeah, let's just go straight on. I think we're okay with the same lineup of guys. I like that squad. Detected an exalt cell operating inside the German border. We'll need strike one to rendezvous with our operative and assist in securing the needed intel. Our operative was in position to transmit the data they'd acquired when exalt forces moved into their AO. The encoder is currently shielding our transmitter's position, but if exalt manages to hack the encoder, they'll be able to locate the transmitter. If they hack both, any hope we had of recovering the data intact will be lost. Okay, so the second... I think this is the second exalt mission, isn't it? And the slightly faffy one. So the key on here is it can you can get overwhelmed by the exalt quite easily so if you kind of take too much for granted. There they are. And the key I always find is getting getting the guys to getting my operative to those relays that stop the exalt being able to fire as long as she's in range of one of those you've got an extra turn to do stuff more important when there's more exalt live which i never remember when they drop in but fairly regularly what are you guys doing what are you doing Commander, we've got multiple hostiles inbound on Strike One's position. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. So there they are. Five life? Five life. Where are you? Uh, where have you gone, Roger, you Charlie. sneaky bastards? Bugger. Mm, uh, ow. Yeah, no. I just gotta be careful. Because she's only got five health. Not amazing armor or anything like that. So, but mind you, she's cleared the Overwatch, so I should be okay with her now. now. Uh, Charlotte. It looks like Exalt deployed a series of communications relays in the area. If our I know that's what I'm counting on, Brad Ford. Using the encryption keys they acquired from Exalt's data, they should be able to temporarily disrupt the enemy's. I know. I know all this. I know. I think Enemy most people watching probably are down. Know as well. That should keep Exalt busy for a while. Yeah, so we've got an extra turn to get around the back of them and, and clear them out, get some good angles on them, flank them potentially. It's the best way to do it, that's all. And move her up so that she's in range of that next one outside. Oh, there you are. Hiding behind the girder. I've targeted him. You should be all right to hit him now. Try hitting him. Good shot. Not good shot. <laughs> needlessly, needlessly cool. Heading there now. Clear to engage. Oh my god. Here they come. They all think they're really cool, don't they? <laughs> so cool. And they all duck down next to a, a car. That car's exploding. Let's see. It's all like trying to figure out how to most effectively kill them all. 
you know, who's got the best shots and things. I think this should blow up the car. Collateral damage? Let's see. I think that, did that blow up? I think it may have done. Just didn't get the animation. Hopefully she can kill him with rapid fire. Two 100% shot. Once you, when you've not been through it for a while, you kind of forget, you know, how, how much stuff. So he's got a good shot there. How much damage and energy they've got and stuff. But I can probably get them with someone else. I've just got to see who I've got an angle on. Roger that. Uh, oh, great. See, that's the thing, isn't it? It's so... XCOM 2 and some of the mods tell you where you move, like... I had a shot there, and he's trying out. to flank, and then you lose sight. Not sure if this will take out the potted plant. Be nice if it did. Four, four damage. Go on, try and get rid of it. We disrupted the enemy communications there. network. It'll take some time for them to get it right. Always feels a little bit cheesy, but you know, I've died enough to on know that it's not cheesy. I've, I've sat, I've. I've taken my punishment many times, and I'm only doing that now because I know it's an option. <laughs> Through having died many times. So they're trying to get to the encoder, but yeah, so it must have exploded. It just didn't blow up in a big explosion. But they're all nearly dead. X-rays got me outflanked. What are you gonna do? I'm trying to. Trying that's a really stupid place to have moved. Someone on the roof. The uh -oh. another group of exalt reinforcements moving into position. Commander. Snipers are the danger. Uh, they've not got the laser weapons yet, but like when they when the snipers get the laser weapons, they are deadly. There's one. Oh my god, they're coming around these sides of me. Uh just you know, rocket's always a good option. I'm not going to get many options because they all spread out pretty heavily. Not got good range. Not a good ra field of fire. There you go. I don't think it blows up the, you know, the thingy thing there. Yeah. Oh. Just uh, I'm just unsure. And it's, they've only got very low health, so we might be able to take these guys out. But I want to leave someone on Overwatch, that's the thing, for the guys coming down from the roof. Decisions, decisions. We'll figure it out, we'll figure it out. Sorry about this. Sometimes you have to think, God. Let's do the stuff that, that's the obvious stuff. She's the best to take him on. Let's get rid of that sniper threat. Can't do rapid fire. This might do it if she crits. Be nice. There he goes. <laughs> Comedy pratfall. Two. And you. Trying to flank me. Pull it! On the move. Go on, love. Go on, pills. The actu the support I think has the better aim in the vanilla game than the sniper. Then support. You'd think it would be the heavy, but it's not. It's the the supports have good good aim. Oh bollocks! Maybe I should have just taken the shot there with the rocket, but. They're gone anyway. Throwing grenade. That should throw them off. It will take Exalt's people some time to get their communications back up and running. We might as well do that while they've got the potential to drop down behind us. Commander, Exalt forces are in position. Ah, balls. If we don't secure that equipment, they'll be able to locate the transmitter. 
All right, so I can't get the thing this turn, so they're going to... This is the first turn where they're really going to be potentially able to shoot us if I don't get rid of them. That's a really good position for him, actually. He's hard cover and, flat and come around the back of us, so we've got to split up now. Try and take him out. Have we got run and gun? I might have run and gun. How best to do it? You see, I've got to... He is going to be able to shoot next turn, so... Let's just get Snowman ready to inter interdict. He's going to interdict. The guys above us. Uh, not the best of things, but pistol with a sniper with laser pistol. Once I upgrade the laser pistols, he could have killed him there. Boom. Getting it done. Reloaded. We're going up. Next turn, we're going upstairs. I'm gonna stop them. Ready to rock. Let's see who turns up this time. Helicopter sounds. What was that? It looks like this is the last of the Let's moved out of some commander. The... We just need to hold out a little longer. Seems to have moved out of the encoder. It's gone Blanco green. Fallado. More of you. They just pull your squad apart a little bit, don't they? With them dropping in behind. We've got to move a fair way to get rid of them. All right, sunshine. That's a very awkward place for him to be. <laughs> yeah. And you. Go on, just get rid of him. Please. Yeah. And he should be an easy target now for someone. It's who I want to go upstairs with. Pills, if she could take him out, that'd be good. No. Nope. Got it covered. Alright. Fragged. The question is. Enemy communications are down. That should keep Exalt busy for a while. Where are you? Where are you? So, uh, you know, even when you've done that, you kind of forget sometimes, don't you? Let's go upstairs, Snowman. You know, that they can be. But they can't fire next turn, so I can take the operative up there and then try and get everyone up next turn. Might as well take this shot. See if we can chip away some damage. Let's chip away some health. Yeah, I know you want your encoder, don't you? You want your information. Right, he's going to be a problem. Two snipers. They all seem to have the ability to move and shoot with their sniper abilities. Which is an ability I could have chosen, but for a drop in accuracy, but I've not gone for that. You know, the enemies always hit, don't they? That's the thing. He's the biggest threat. Let's remove his cover. Echo doing a lot of work with his pistol at the moment. Which is kind of cool. I like it when the snipers get a chance to do something slightly different. Just, just see who else we can take out because we might need to use that shot for something else. Just gotta watch we don't hit the encoder. I thought I'd misclick there. 80%. Come on. Good so shot. Happy. No, it was Oh, shit. Right, let's see. Come on, misclick. Love it. Really nice. So you can guarantee this kill. Let's just use the two grenades. And there you go. Transmitter is secure, and it looks like that was the last of nice. the forces in the Happy area. with that. Happy so with that. Work. We're going to have a few more missions like that now. As we kind of dig in and 
do various Looks stuff. Like so, Sergeant. And without so much as a scratch. Again, I w suppression is good, but I, I get more out of Shredder Rocket. Combat drugs or dense smoke. I'd rather have defense for emergencies, personally. And Charlotte's going up. My, our covert op. She's going to become our a backup medic, which is cool. Just through doing the ops, they get good experience. Don't like the name Kong, so I want him to sound a bit cool. Sidewinder, Hellfire. He's, he's the name of his missiles is Hellfire. He's he's full of hell, and fire. So that kind of makes sense. So scope upgrade, lab carapace armor is the main thing that I'm waiting for for the next. Is the next big bump in survivability. Might as well get genetics going and see what we can do with it. We've not got much meld, and I think I'll need most of the meld for my mech upgrades, but we may be get able to get some key things. Mimetic skin is very powerful. Excavation becomes very expensive as you go further down. That's why it's like you don't overextend, and I sometimes forget that. And finally, I always like when it gets to the stage where I've got my uplinks and I've got some satellites and I don't have to worry about it. So scope upgrade is good. It's good. It's one of those things that's not very... So we've got our laboratory online. So our research is going to get better. Laboratory online. Commander, there's a priority one transmission coming in Ooh. from the council. Council mission. Oh, it's uh, Van Dorn. Right, this is a tough mission, but I'm tackling this later on. I usually get this mission earlier, so should be doable. Okay, thanks guys for watching. Really appreciate your support, and I will see you next time when we're going to rescue the annoying Bandorn. No, no, no. No, no.